New York state lawmakers have less than an hour if they want to pass the 2015-2016 budget before the start of the fiscal year tomorrow. WNY's Leander Rosa sat down with WNY political analyst Jim Twombly to get his opinion on the budget and joins us now in the studio. Leanne. Asia, Dr. Jim Twombly says he thinks this budget could very well be passed on time, especially since it looks like this budget focused on compromise. Education and ethics reform versus minimum wage and the DREAM Act. These are just some of the topics that were included and some that were cut from the 2015-2016 New York State budget. WENY's political analyst Dr. Jim Twombly says it looks like Governor Andrew Cuomo was compromising. I think a willingness to compromise and say, well, all right, well, we'll take up these other things that are important to me after the budget demonstrates that they were important, but also that he's willing to give them up for the sake of getting the budget done on time. Twombly says some of these topics may be important or controversial, but they don't necessarily need to be a budget item. The budget has typically been used as this key piece of legislation that has to be paid attention to, um, so people use it to make these principled stands on policy and try to get things through that wouldn't normally get through on their own or might take up too much time on their own. Um, but we've seen in the past when that's happened, the budget's been late. Twombly feels the ethics reform proposal was one of Governor Cuomo's compromises, but is a good first step. He had wanted um, more teeth to the ethics reform, um, and he wanted stricter consequences, tighter consequences for the legislators if they didn't meet those requirements. That's what's not there. Minimum wage increases, most likely another compromise. But that doesn't mean these issues won't be a discussion in the future. Let's not hold up negotiations over some of the more delicate parts of the budget with the Senate Republicans, for example, over something like the minimum wage and have that as a separate argument after we get the budget passed. If the budget is passed before midnight, it will be the fifth year in a row that it's passed on time, which compares to a nearly 20 year streak of being passed late. Twombly says that's a sign everyone's working together and overall avoids a ripple effect of consequences. In the studio, Leanne DeRosa, WENY News.